Hello, my friends. Today I have a lovely little story that is simply titled Michael that I would like to read for you. Would it be okay if I sit here with you? He heard. As he looked up, he saw a well-dressed man smiling at him. There were a few other empty tables in this little campus cafe at the university he was studying at, but this man appeared to be a professor, and so he kindly nodded in agreement, replying, you sure can. The professor sat down across from him, and he noticed there was a cup of coffee on the table that the professor must have already set down. My name is Michael, the professor said, and for the next few minutes they talked. The professor seemed to be kind and was a very good listener as he shared that he was getting breakfast really quickly before going to his first class. When he happened to share that it was his first semester on campus and that he didn't know where his class was, the professor replied, oh, that will be in Medore Hall and gave him some directions across campus to get there. Soon after, he expressed his thanks and got up to head off to class, leaving the friendly p professor behind. He knew he needed to be in a hurry, but he had agreed with the cute cashier to pay after he ate. And so he walked over to take care of that. With appreciation for the help of the professor that sat with him, he asked if he could also pay for the cup of coffee the professor had gotten. But when he looked over to the table he was sitting at, no one was there. The cup of coffee even was gone. This was the only way in and out, and it was just a one-room cafe, so it didn't seem possible that the professor would have left already. Yet looking around, the professor was nowhere there. He was quite confused and a little embarrassed now from even bringing it up with the cashier, but she surprised him with a comment of understanding. I have seen him here a time or two before, she said. That was Archangel Michael, who you were sitting with. As I further wrote when I shared this story in writing, sometimes an angel will show up appearing as a human, but we tend not to notice as we often just glance by. What they show up to help with could even seem so insignificant to us. Maybe an angel will show up just to appear to be a person who is, a, who is admiring a pretty flower. Whether they are noticed or not, angels are everywhere with us. At times, an angel will appear to help us in a way we can't deny, though. And you might be surprised at how many simple things that the angels which are beings that many understandably and correctly associate with miracles, guide us through every day. Perhaps even Archangel Michael has shown up to give you some directions. I felt called to share this story today. I have many stories of angels that I've written and there will be many more um, I also have quite a few stories as well, love stories, many that follow two lovers that I have created um, and follow kind of like a timeline um, of, and I have been wanting to share more of those. Um, and I have um, shared some uh, through these videos, uh, many of them laced with my stories of angels as well though. Um, but what I keep feeling called to share through these videos that I've been making it are the stories of the angels that I've written. And so that must be what is needed um, at this time and through these videos. But I do hope to get to, to more of my love stories as well. Um, I do want to share um, that we all have a guardian angel that is with us. Um, an angel that is... Um, with us from before we are born even. Our souls get to know them uh, long before we, we come into this life. 
um, and they are with us all throughout this life and after bring our soul on whatever you would consider on to be and our guardian angel loves us so much and is always communicating with us so your guardian angel is always communicating with you and you do hear them whether you realize it or not and I think that will be helpful for some of us to, to recognize and to hear. Um, just remember that your guardian angel is right by your side um, and you can talk with them and um, hear them um, and be guided by them. You always are. I wish you all love and I hope you have a lovely day. Thank you so much.